doesn't find it. Samirin player. McInnes just trying to hold on to the ball, but he has given it away. It's Brobo. Oh, what a goal. Ryan Brobo gives TNS a short lead here at the Paisley 2021 Stadium. You really can't argue with the strike, but Samirin so many times this season caught in possession in dangerous areas and losing goals from it yeah I mean that was a great one from there wasn't it just unleashed the right foot and it hits the top right hand corner of the net no chance for uh, Billy O'Brien to go there but you know as you say once again and how many times have we said it Daniel we gave away possession in a bad area and just put ourselves under pressure um, and you know it's a bit of an uphill struggle for us now to be honest because we just haven't shown anything. Return and he gets it. It's a good pass out to him again. Still going, Stephen McGinn takes it into space. Oh, brilliant strike by Stephen McGinn. It's his first goal for Samaria first returning. Ryan Brobo with your heart out. What a goal. Samaria one, TNS one. Incredible. What a run from McGinn there. He just buried that. That is what we need. You know, and they said that how McGinnis could have been doing that earlier, but he really took it on there. You can see how what it means to him as well. You can hear what it means to the fans. Here we go, there's a delay off. I told you they didn't call him top in for nothing. What a goal! Turn it on to his right foot and just buries it in the top corner. And you can almost see the minute we've gone out, he made a wee jump for him. You can see what was on his mind. Fantastic. Lloyd. Oh, it might come back through, through here for McGinn again. Oh, that was a very oh, late challenge there precious. from Stephen Saunders. The referee's going to his back pocket. Oh, a red yeah. card for the former Motherwell and Ross County man. The new Saints are down to 10 men just after the hour mark here. Keith Kennedy calling for the physio here. Yeah, well, that was that was quite a vicious one, wasn't it? I'm not surprised at the red card there. They just took McGinn out. Um, you know, and once again, I think it just shows how rattled um, the New Saints are here because that was a, a foolish one to give away in that position. It's cost him a free kick in a dangerous area. It's cost him a man. Although, as we know, sometimes you know, playing against 10 men becomes difficult for a team. But Saunders taking the, the slow... Trudge off here. Just looking at the replay here. So the New Saints down to 10 men. And Stevie Mallon from about 21, 22 yards out has a chance to put some in ahead. TNS1 Turn the sea Put them under the cross Just now Turn that door And get the goal Listen to the fans Singing the name Of Lee Stevie Mellon That's what he was doing Consistently last year um, I just noticed The uh, TNS goalkeeper Kicking his goal person Discussed there Not much he could have done about that it Just crept in under him At the left hand post You know TNS now they really have an up Morgan's header finds McGinn and Morgan has continued at the left hand side is the obvious option. Here he is again. Morgan, oh, oh, a hard ball. Yeah, there is. It's a penalty now to Simmerin. The handball from Aaron Edwards. The referee judging that he had his hand in an unnatural position. Well, I just thought that was it. He threw his hands up, you know, and uh, here we come, here we go. Oh yeah, yeah, no, yeah no he doesn't need to have that. his hands there, does he? No need for that, no. Um, so, so, really, a chance for us to put it to bed, you would think, isn't there? Well, the last time we had a penalty here was against uh, United in the 1-1 draw in December, which Lauren Shankland missed completely. And it's going to be John Sutton who's going to step up to take this here. Stevie Mallon usually was the penalty taker, but... Yeah. It's Sutton looking for his 11th goal of the season. Looking for Samirin's third. Saved by Paul Harrison. Yeah, that was really just empty feet. Mallon looking for McGinnis, but he gave the ball away. Demetriou can intercept this, and he does. 
Dimitriou and McGuinness still going McGuinness he's done really well and there's the ball this time from John Sutton Samirin 3 TNS 1 and that looks to be the goal that will send Samirin into the Iron Brew Cup final yeah I mean Sutton also making amends to his ball to miss there but that was just you Dimitriou came in ran in the ball Got it into McGuinness, who keep kept running with it, got it across the field to the goal, and Sutton was there to put it as away, as you'd expect, with a player of his caliber. TNS, final throw of the dice for them, they're throwing the last sub on. The sports are going off. Well, I wish we might have the numbers here, because set number four was coming on. Rather more than I think we expected. Yeah. Do you Alan. think can a team collapse in three minutes? Oh, there's oh, the yeah! fourth. A well watched free kick that really puts the game to bed. And it's reward for a fine second half performance from Samirin. Right yeah. at the start of stoppage time, Samirin 4, the New Saints 1. Yeah, that was just once again so well taken. Uh, you know, and I think it's probably given Bindi Wright as manager. Just something to go back and think about, you know, when he, he sees a second half revival here. Aurora Loy nets his second goal.